you're gonna wish you were able to go back in time and show this exercise to your past self because of how powerful it is. It's super simple, it takes less than a minute, and all you have to do is make sounds, okay? No words, but if it's true for you, go uh-huh, and if it's not true for you, go uh-uh. You can do like meh and mm, just sounds, okay? No words. What I'm looking to do is get your sacral response, not an explanation or thoughts from your head. I'm looking to get from here in the belly. So let's do this. Take a deep breath in and let it go. Do you like running? Are you outside? Did you drink enough water today? Did you talk to your best friend today? Do you love yourself? Are you holding your phone in your right hand? Are you thinking that I'm going too fast for you to respond? Are you following the rules of using sounds only and not words? Are you indoors? Can you see the sky? Can you touch a plant from where you're standing? Are you standing? Are you sitting? Can you touch a plant from wherever you are? Do you like what you do for money? Do you feel like you make enough money? Is there something else you'd like to be doing in exchange for money? Are you hungry? Are you horny? Are you well rested? Are you tired? Do you miss your dad? Do you miss your mom? Do you have any siblings? Do you have a favorite sibling? Do they know that they're your favorite sibling? Do you have any pain in your body? Do you know what to do to help alleviate that pain? Are you a generator? Are you a manifesting generator? Are you a non sacral type in human design? Do you know what your human design is? Okay, great, breathe in and let it out. Let's talk about this. So like I said in the beginning, the whole point of this exercise is to get answers from the gut, not from the brain. Because the brain does a really great job of contextualizing the environment, but the gut does a much better job of helping you make decisions that are good for you. See, when we rely on the brain to make decisions and the mind to make decisions, a lot of the time, the sacral response, the true authentic desire for you it's pushed down, suppressed. And then this is where the people pleaser bullshit comes into play. Codependent relationships, toxic relationships, all that stuff comes from making decisions with the head as opposed to the gut. Now in human design, we're divided into five types. Those five are divided into two types. The two types are sacral beings and non-sacral beings. Now sacral beings have this center colored in, this red one right here. This sacral is a motor center, meaning it provides energy, specifically energy to build. And the more satisfying the thing that you're building, the stronger the uh-huh is gonna be. This is also gonna provide the uh-uh if you do not have energy or the thing that you're about to invest energy into seems stupid to you. Unworthy, we'll say unworthy of your energy. It's not, it's not a good use of your sexual creative life force because that's what this is. Now, the 70% of people have this defined. There are the manifesting generators and the generators. So for those of you with the defined sacral generators and manifesting generators, all you gotta do is follow that sacral response. It will lead you towards satisfaction, away from frustration, and you will just be living your best life. For those of us with the undefined sacral, this is still an excellent practice to utilize. Very important for us non-sacral beings to understand the difference and embody the difference between a gut response and a thought. And of course, the only way to discern the difference between the thoughts and the gut responses is to practice with it. So if you don't know which type you are, visit my website. You can generate a body graph totally for free. I have $20 reports that'll explain everything you need to know up front. Book a session with me if you wanna do a one-on-one. -on -one. I also do relationship readings, family readings, and business readings. I have an awesome Discord community. We have an amazing app, which this graphic is from, Neutrino Design. All of that stuff is in the link here in my bio at reikimarco.com. And let me know how you're feeling did this resonate with you was there anything tricky about it did you feel like i was moving too fast is there anything that you want to hear in these sacral calibrations specifically to help you because again this is designed to help you this is designed to help you get real with yourself and the overthinking has no more grip on the sacral so congratulations for starting this journey send it to someone like it and save it if this was helpful peace